Hello everybody. Um oof. I'm actually am I am I late to the queue? I was, I was I was setting up the stream. I think I'm late to the queue. Am I? What the Can I not do uh, duels here? Oh my god, I can't even do duels here. Oh dude, this is a tragedy. I'm late to the queue. So uh Oh no, dude! Get back here, dudes! I can't do I can't do duels outside. So I gotta leave first. Hey Athens, hey Ties. So. You ate a rally today. How did that go? <laughs> so I actually just missed a queue by like 20 seconds. No! <clears throat> All right, I'm slightly tilted. Uh, I guess it's fine though because there is some stuff that I wanted to level up. I wanted to add another level or two to these. Wait, wait, wait. So I gotta open up my... All I've been doing for Blood Moon... Uh, like soloing people, doing bloodies, doing... Oh, I guess I opened them already. So... Go to my hero, look at my John. Enhance, enhance. How many can I do? Ooh, I can do a couple. That's pretty nice, having it at plus 5. For all of them. That's pretty good. So I think I'm gonna do Haral's next. Cause uh, Haral needs some love. Uh, play Lords every now and then. <laughs> so I'm gonna go with a cheaper route. I'm gonna level up the other one. Though, uh... I should have done another bloody or two. <clears throat> hmm. Okay. The Q should start soon. I think I'm rank one right now. I am rank one. Uh, man, I took a bunch of losses this morning. I was pretty, I was pretty tilted, <clears throat> but I turned it around. Um, I play a little bit of Lords. I log in to use Convocation. I use the Holy Stars Familiar. I use the Gem Familiar. I uh, train some uh, heroes in the gym. Uh, <laughs> I can't really say that I actually play the game. <coughs> how big was the rally and how big are you? So this is my new comp. I run John, Toma, Rand, and Haral. I no longer have Maria. And I kind of regret not having Maria anymore because I invested a lot of blue cards into Maria. Man, you know what it is? Usually it's when it's usually when you get a, like a lower rank player, they never click ready. They never click ready and you're sitting here for the entire minute. But I guess that's how that's how I used to be as well, right? Uh, if if he pulls, then I don't use it. Okay, so he's not gonna pull. I kind of just want to kill this right here. Well, I can't, so I'm gonna kill this instead. <laughs> Ooh. <clears throat> so that death knight is actually doing a lot of damage to me. See, he walks up, I can smack these guys. Okay, good. Dude, my Mighty Blow does an insane amount of damage now. Or uh, my my Deathly Strike, that is. Well, Mighty Blow does a lot of damage too. So, it's pretty cool. <clears throat> I 
Mm, I lost a couple of games to this guy, and I lost two to Tough Fire. Yeah, so I lost to Tough Fire, and I lost to uh, Fuckface, which sucks. Because every single time I lose a game, I lose like five, six games worth of points. And they made the time slots uh, 30 minute time periods, but they gave us two more time periods, so it's every six hours. But <clears throat> there's a, there's a, what's called, like a two minute time period where you can't do anything. Uh, I did some Blood Moon and I'll always take the time out to, to do duels. But as you can see here, I've done a little bit of Blood Moon already. And uh, to be honest, Rosie and Fearless are above me because they're sitting in capital. They've gotten like 3 billion points sitting in capital. <clears throat> I had some pretty good solos really on in, really early on in Blood Moon. I got 30 million kills within the first... Uh... Do I take this 50-50? Oh, he doesn't even go for it. I killed this first, right? <gasps> Dude, I just got cucked! Um, I got- I gotta do this here, right? What was that? Dude! Oh my god, is this for real? I've never seen that interaction. I'm actually so tilted right now. My- Oh my god, how, how many points does this guy have? Oh dude, I'm so tilted. Minus 14? Dude, that is so many games. Ah, oh. I gotta rewatch that, man. That's, that's insane how those heroes move. Typically, those heroes never move unless something dies. I've never seen that happen before. And it moved twice. That's a... Oh, dude. I'm heated. I'm heated. I'm mad. I lost to a 1,200, dude. 14 points. 14 points. Uh, how about you guys? <laughs> how you doing? <laughs> Rank one in duels, by the way. <coughs> they need to lower the, the queue time. Because two minutes is too long. Two minutes is far too long. Honestly, the queue time should be a max of a minute, 30 seconds or something. Right? Because in the end, even when the queue stops, you don't immediately get into another game. You wait for maybe like 5, 10 seconds or something like that, right? You don't immediately get into another game. So if you have to wait two minutes in between games, and then there's like a pre-staging of, of one minute, then you don't really get a lot of time to play, especially since they lowered the, the play period. But man... 14 points, holy shit. That guy was smurfing on me. He was smurfing on me. Uh, I screwed up. That's kind of what I do in INS. I just, uh, I type something like, uh, anyone gay or something like that. Okay, Napalm. Napalm's one of the higher guys. I think I'm gonna get like two or three points if I win this. I lose uh, 10 to 12 if I if I lose. Man, 14? 14 is fucking huge. Do I go for the 50-50? I went for the 50-50. And I owned him. Okay.
I went for the 50-50, lost the 50-50, but he didn't get my Rand, which was bad for him. I'm just gonna go for this right here. <clears throat> because it doesn't really do him much good, because all his heroes are dead here. <clears throat> there it is. Okay, so I take a win off of Napalm. Pretty good. I'm using another Fatal Blow here. But uh, man, those the three levels that I gave my John really helped a lot. Oh shit, man. I'm pissed. Uh, let's see. Let's look at my record from this morning. Look at this. I peaked at... Oh, you, you don't even see what my peak was. It was it was all the way down here. I lost it last night. I think I peaked at uh, 1867 was my peak. Uh, you, know, you know, there's this like... What emulator am I using? I'm using LD player. I stopped using Nox because Nox actually just feels like a, a piece of turd, man. Nox just, uh, it's super slow nowadays. I, uh, and another thing that I've been saying for a while now, though I haven't said it for a while because, uh, it's not new anymore, right? I've been using LD player for a while, but when I first got converted over to LD player, I was like, holy shit, everything is so smooth. It's, it's 720p, 1080p, and I can have multiple clients open, right? Um... Where is it? So, right here, right? I typically will have five clients open when uh, I'm doing defiled rallies, which I haven't done for a while. And so I have my main account running rallies and then I join it on my alts. But Nox doesn't even give me two clients that run nicely. For LD player, I can run five clients at 720p and my main client at 1080p, and I don't lag at all. So it was, it was a big change. Also, uh, LD player has uh, it has a macro that you can actually that you can actually what's it called <clears throat> that you can program. It's this one right here, and uh, you can. You can start recording and then you can edit the script. Nox took that out a few years ago. So that uh, it only does recordings. You can no longer edit your recording script. Which is... Uh, I don't know why they took it out. That was probably one of the best things about Nox. Because uh, you know how it is, right? When, when, when you screw up, when you're... When you're doing something. I think he's going to pull me to the side. What's he doing? You don't do something, bud? Oh, let me, let me put this up, and then I'm going to execute this guy. <clears throat> uh, I think I want to just stun these two dragons to remediate the damage that I'm taking. Because I rely on Rand's aura. Dude, what is my John doing all the way back there? Okay, so I have to do something like this. Uh, I still have a Lord's account. Does that count? You know, I think it would it would net me more points if I just summoned ogres. Oh, dude. All right, I gotta summon ogres because this guy's gonna keep doing this thing, where he where he just hits me over and over again, and it's actually pretty annoying. Because uh, I can't really do anything about it. All, all I can do to to do something about this is to summon more ogres. <clears throat> so he's going to keep summoning his dragons. Which is annoying. So all, all I can really do about this is to, to just counteract his summons. It doesn't really net me that much to, to shield up. I gain more HP if I summon an ogre.
Yeah, right. <clears throat> it's not even mine, dude. It's Ramrod's. How do I give away something that's not mine? That's, uh, you know... Unethical. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. Mm. Oh. I could be doing these. Because there is a world event going on right now. Oh, actually, I'm gonna be training troops. Because I want to train some more tier 3s. Hello? This one. Okay. Research. That. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So the, the funny thing about Tough Fire is that he always, always, always copies my composition. He always copies my composition. <clears throat> so, of course, it being my composition, I know how to deal with it, right? <clears throat> and the reason why I have Toma instead of, instead of Haral is solely because of the fact that with Toma, my heroes don't get one shot. And uh, as you can see right here, uh, I actually don't mind when people copy my strat, right? Because it's the biggest form of flattery, right? When people copy exactly what you do, but they make some kind of variation to it, right? <clears throat> I'll do some Blood Moon after this, but I mean, the only thing I'm doing for Blood Moon is... Uh, well, <laughs> I'll show you what my Stronghold tab in Blood Moon looks like. <laughs> It's pretty much just strongholds. Look at look at how much uh, iron I farm. Actually, I used a bunch of iron, but uh, I think a good weight of how much I farmed is is this right here. That's how much wood I farm from uh, from from Blood Moon, and it's also because like my iron count was a little low for the reason that I have been training. A bunch of troops. I look, 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 at how, look at how much stone I have and stuff. Right? This, uh, well, this, this right here. I think you get the 500k stacks from uh, from Blood Moon. I did figure out the rally size. It was, it's it's just because of uh, capital itself. That's how much capital holds. So it's actually a first come first serve thing, and it goes up to 10 mil. <clears throat> The first come first serve thing. <coughs> hey Bettina, I see I, I seen that uh, you've been playing again. I see you in in the world chat every now and then. Uh, you're in some other guild though. I think you're in STX or what? One of the S guilds, SFO, one of those guilds, and uh, you kind of get dumped on. I've seen you get zeroed a couple times, like you you forget your shield or something, and then you just get ransacked. Um, <laughs> but it happens to the best of us, right? Even even I even I got zeroed that uh, like two weeks ago, and uh, it wasn't very nice. But now I have a good amount of troops. I'm gonna push some more troops, and I think I want to push that troop count to 130, 140 mil. So I'm gonna make some troops. And then I'm gonna go into Blood Moon. <clears throat> Dude, this queue time takes forever, man. Oh, dude, go figure. I get, I get a, I get a 1200. Well, I mean, I can't really say anything bad about 1200s because I just lost to a 1200. And so basically, right now, I'm just playing to get the points that I lost back. Oh my God, he has. Oh, this is the guy with three dragons. Oh no, dude! Oh. I kind of miscalculated it. I thought that, uh... What's it called? That Rand would walk further up, but he didn't. But I think that I'm gonna kill his Rand before it gets up, which is good. Okay, good. 
He dumps another meteor shower? I'm not too worried about it. <clears throat> okay. So, these games suck. Like, these games suck. The people that run dragons, it sucks playing against them. Because there's just nothing that I can do about it. it I'm literally just sitting here waiting. For, for the entire two minutes, and then I had to wait for the two-minute queue again. Um, not very fond of it, and uh, what's worse is when your heroes are like all the way in the corner and they can't even reach these guys. So, uh, I can maybe do this right here, but... Uh, did I get it? Okay, perfect. So, <laughs> I stunned his, his, his Laura before... She could summon anything. And I'm gonna wait. <clears throat> because I want to end this as soon as possible. Is he gonna summon another one? Okay, okay. Kill it? Kill it? Kill it? Oh, I saved! Eight seconds. Let's go, baby. <laughs> if there's one advice I can give you guys in Lord's Mobile, and that is if Lurker links something to Rally, turn around, kick him from the guild, and forget about it. 14 million troops? Oh man, that's juicy. I'll show you guys my, my Blood Moon hits after I... Uh, after this duel session. <coughs> Dude, I don't even have enough scrolls. Oh my god. I, man, these one-point games and the one-point games taking forever is actually such a tilter. I've only played one guy that gave me a good amount of points. And I played a guy with dragons twice. Oh. Okay. So, uh, I'm, I'm glad that this guy is trolling. Because that means I get to go into another game. Thank you, Adergal. You're the best. Woo! Save some time in that one, dude. That guy, that guy is, that guy's a beast. All right. Though I did lose to a twelve hundred, so you know, uh, when for some reason there's heroes that walk away and stuff like that when nothing's happening. Uh, it is what it is, man. You you, you lose the games that you lose. It sucked. Fourteen points, man. Fourteen points. 14 points, dude! He gained 19. That was insane. Uh, hey, TNT. How's C4, dude? <laughs> you still in C4? I played against one guy that gave me a decent amount of points. Every single one has been one-pointers. Actually, I played two guys that gave me good points. I played against Napalm and Toughfire. What do you mean Lords make sense? Lords have been the same thing for the past three years. Nothing has changed about that game. Nothing. No mechanics. Nothing. Oh, dude. He used John for some weird reason. Okay. My Herald does more damage, by the way. So if, if we just keep trading Fatal Blows like this, it's obviously not beneficial for him because uh, I have uh, I have some pretty jacked heroes. So that, that was pretty funny. He kept trading, he kept trading skills with me. It doesn't work like that, man. <clears throat> How about taking 19 rallies in research gear. 
Haral is too OP, man. Haral has the best skill in the game. So, that's actually who I'm going to pump in my next uh, bit of dimensional runes. Uh, because, look at him, he's just not hes just not being treated well at all. And then, when you look at my John, my John has plus 15. I think I have some on Maria, but I don't use- Oh my god, dude, look, look at how much I have on Maria. Oh my god, dude, that's so many runes, man! Dude, that guy is insane. I, I still can't believe that they soloed that many, that many troops. Oh no! Come on, man! It's another. It's an. It's another one pointer. Man, I'm not digging the one point games. Uh come on, come on. So basically, I lost the game and. Ah, I'm putting a moving kingdoms. <laughs> that might be that might be a, a good choice. So the guys with Carl, I'm typically a lot more lenient because it doesn't last that long, and I can just do this. Though I uh, I got I got owned there. So let's see what happens here. I gotta kill his Maria. Okay, good. So I killed his Maria. I was really hoping... Do, do I get it? Aw, oh, dude! He's cancelled my, my stun twice. But I feel bad about this one because I won this one solely because of stats. I won this one solely because of stats. This guy actually, like, if this guy had as, as many upgrades as I do, then I would have lost. But uh, you know, it is what it is. Sometimes I feel I feel I feel really shitty whenever I lose games like that because when you look at Bake's heroes and then you look at my heroes, right? It's it's a landslide of a difference. Bake has like plus ten on all of his runes. He's got uh, plus fifteen level forty gear on his uh, on his on his heroes, right? So his blue John does as much damage as his blue plus two John does as much damage as my immortal plus one John. It's actually insane. I think I might be at a hundred dimensional points because I've been in Blood Moon the entire time. Uh, I hope not. I think I used them earlier, but I really hope not because that would suck. I do think that I did use them earlier, so, uh... But I gotta go check that after this. I've been, I've been neglecting those dimensional points. I think I only cashed it in maybe once or maybe twice today. I'm not sure, though. And, uh, hopefully I didn't cap out, because I don't exactly know when the last time I turned it in was. Let's see. What does this look like? Man, once upon a time, I was at 85%. 530 <laughs> yeah 530 oh napalm okay 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 so napalm almost got me before he his haral stun canceled my haral stun but i used rand shield to to counter his um his deathly strike so the reason why mine was late was because i wanted to hit his haral Let's see if he does it. <gasps> I might lose this. Oh, I got the cancel. I got the cancel. So I got the cancel, which means that uh, I'm just going to do this right here. Even though it's not going to do any damage, it's going to stun his dudes. And so I get to do this right here. Mm, clap, baby! Woo! I thought I, thought I might have been dead there. Because 
his 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 fatal blow canceled my deathly strike and fatal blow cost 25 and it canceled out at 35 cost skill to be honest i don't understand why he didn't uh he didn't he didn't deathly strike there because deathly strike would have killed something right it could have killed my my rand it could have killed my haral it could have killed my my john but instead he opted to use shield and i don't get that because it wasn't one of those uh, fatal blow trades where my fatal blow hits and then his hits or something like that right it was one of those interactions where he just completely canceled out my fatal blow so that was a bad misplay on his part especially because he saw that i used fatal blow and he was up 10 mana on that trade right he was up 10 mana actually he was up 35 mana because my my deathly strike did zero damage uh okay so i checked dimensional battle oh yes i did use it okay good so i think i want to level up my john again he is a couple of runes away he is 10 runes away so i will be leveling him up so by the time the next duel hits in six hours i will have a plus two john nice boom says you're mean how many scrolls do i need i need six scrolls right now uh <clears throat> so i'm at 12 i need 18. i'm gonna train some troops I think I can get two or three scrolls from guild coins. <coughs> Your one bill trap can take a hit from a 10 bill player. Uh, it, it just depends, right? Our kingdom's not opening up for another month or two or something like that, right? So I'm just going to complete this because I kind of want this. Uh, this. Wait. There's something extra here. Whatever, I don't care. So, I'm gonna complete these because I want the points. Wait, is this a world or is this? Oh, this is a world. Oh, okay. So I gotta go into Blood Moon, right? I gotta go into Blood Moon to get that one. Uh, where is it? Do I have any more? I don't think I have any more. Dude, I've been running out of... I've been running low on gold. And I never thought that gold was something that I would actually ever run low on. But, you know, it's... It's what happens when you never really give yourself gold for guild activities. But I don't mind it. The next time I top up, the gold will come back up. Uh, we're in 517. We migrated a couple days ago. What the heck is this? Hello? Game? Hello? Okay. So, there's a different event in here. So I did the world event, which kind of sucked that I, I trained the tier 6 for that event. Because I didn't really want to. Uh, I gotta make sure that I'm in talents. Oh, wait a minute. That means I don't have the 10% off. Uh, do I just do it without the 10% off? Uh, I'll just do it without the 10% off, man. Fuck it. Fuck it. Oof. Because we have the sanctuary at 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 uh at the regular the regular base. So Damn, these guys are boosting a bunch of stuff. Well, me too. Mm, where is it? Let me just boost a bunch of stuff and then I'll do some... Uh... Did I really use all the one minute speed ups? That's unsettling. I'm gonna queue up a research first and then I'll make some troops. How much time do I have? I have 15 minutes. I have 15 minutes to make some troops. And all I'm going to be making are tier 3s. So, uh, 
Swap on over to skills. <clears throat> and then... Wait a minute, wait a minute. Buffs first. Buffs first. One. Two. Three. Alright, so... Time to make some more cavalry. Yikes, I should have popped this before. these pop these hmm from the looks of it i could just pop the three hours I want to go up to like 60 or 90 mil, but I think this batch isn't going to give me that much. This batch is going to give me like 10-ish 10, 10 mil. Dude, Bettina, what's going on, man? I'm, I'm free to play too. The only thing that sucks about training tier 3 is that you have to scroll. If you're just training tier 4s, then you could just click that little sliver on the corner. And it would be perfectly fine. Wait, I thought Bluey went to sleep. I guess not. Uh, I kind of want to click that, but I'm on a... Dude, what in the fuck? If there's one thing that they can change... It's that huge ass sanctuary notification. Like no one needs to see that. No one cares. <laughs> hey Carrie. That's a new name. Uh what brings you here? Welcome, by the way. That could, that could be how, that could be how I came to be. I'm not exactly sure how that went down, but uh, <laughs> that's pretty funny. It sucks that I don't have that 10% because ideally I would be able to train what like like four or five more percent because it's uh, it's not it's not a multiplicative 10 percent it's an additive 10 percent to my 20 point something percent that i already have uh but for the sake you know it would have actually been better because the teleport only costs 5k but what about this i'm rank 15 Well, in the end, I am I am not training uh, what's called Tier 6, so I have 10 more minutes of clicking until the 10% is gone from the, the buff. So bear with me, guys. I'm just going to be training troops for the next 10 minutes. That, uh, that 20k buff only lasts for 5 minutes. Or 15 minutes. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Did I switch back to training talents? Or am I using research talents right now? Okay, 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 dude. Dude, dude, I, I would've been pretty pissed.
Oh, I see. Yo, thanks for subbing, man. I'm too lazy. You know, I'm halfway through it already. You know, it's, uh, I'm at that point where it's too late to turn. Oh my God, dude. I can't see anything, man. I hate how it's not even opaque, right? That notification is not even opaque. So when, when that thing comes on screen, you just can't see anything behind it. Like you see how this is somewhat opaque, somewhat translucent, right? For that notification, it's completely black. You just can't see the background. Mm, eight minutes, eight minutes, got eight minutes. Eight more minutes of training tier threes. Five, 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 five. I need to just macro this. But the thing is, with, with dragging mechanics, it's not so... Ooh, what the hell did I just drop? I heard like... Oh, I have a spoon that dropped. I do have food. I have some, uh, some uh, British pasty is what it's called. It's just sitting here. I have... Uh, just sitting in the styrofoam that I got it in. It's called, uh, it's called a British steak pasty. Looks like this. Looks like this. Looks like this. Uh, but I will be munching on that. I'd be a nice zero. I've gotten zeroed once before. I've gotten zeroed once before. And uh, it wasn't nice. <laughs> it wasn't nice. It was not nice. Seven minutes. Roughly seven minutes, that is. You know, whenever whenever you train troops in Lords Mobile, people love watching that shit. But this is somewhat more tedious than training troops in Lords Mobile because it takes you out the screen, you gotta go back in and over and over again, right? You gotta scroll back. It's like two or three times more clicks because in Lords Mobile, you can just click... Uh, Finish now, right, is, is the button in Lord's Mobile. If you have enough resources, if you have enough everything, right, it doesn't cost you more gems, it just costs you the speed up amount, you can just keep clicking finish now. But for for this game, you gotta keep scrolling through, scrolling back, you go back and you click in. Uh, I mean, accidentally click upgrade every now and then because you're retarded, uh, like me. Uh, how many has that been? That's been 30 mil, right? Or 20 mil. I've added 20 mil because I started at 30 mil. How many troops do I have? I have, I think, 110 mil right now. Pushing 120 mil. Oh, wait, wait. I did train those, uh, the 400k tier 6, right? From the 80-something days for uh, both of them. So, I think I'm at 120 right now. Bear with me guys, five more minutes. I'm actually gonna pop some resources to meet the, to meet the, uh, what's called the timer. Because I wanna keep doing this for as much as possible. Oh, come on, dude. Sometimes you click that, oh, oh, oh c come on, man. That's like, that's like a whole training session right there. You, you see that Sanctuary Conquered thing? It's so, oh dude, come on. Everything, everything is getting in the way. The sanctuary notification, the blunder, the fuck up. Ooh, 17 bill, let's go. Wait, I'm actually, this is what, uh, oh, c come on. So this is 16.5 bill or 16.95 bill. <clears throat> Dude, if you were free to playing efficiently, you would be able to train this many troops. 
All right? So, you got to step up, Bettina. All right? Shape up. Shape up so you can train 30 million troops in 15 minutes, okay? Dude. Dude, I cannot see shit. If everybody in Blood Moon could just stop hitting sanctuaries for the next four minutes, I would appreciate you so much. Thank you. No, wrong button! Come on, come on! Yo, I do hope that we win the, the Blood Moon as well. <clears throat> It'd be nice, but you know how it is, right? The only reason that we're able to to accumulate all these points is because we're holding pretty much all of the sanctuaries, we're holding the capital, but once the Chinese and the Japanese dudes wake up, yeah, that's gonna that's gonna go away. Because if it's a 70 bill guy holding base, good luck. We're not we're not taking that. So Yo gear team, brother! I gotta check how much time I have exactly. Four minutes. I got four minutes. Uh oh. What am I low on? So I'm a, lo a little low on this. A little low on this. A little low on this. That's too much. Oh, can, can I even hit 200? Can I do that in time? That's like 10 clicks. One. All right. Have faith in the clicking. 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 You can hit one bill? Do it, dude. Actually, don't do it, man. Because in this game, research is key. If you don't have the research, you're just going to get fucking bent over. You're going to get bent over, you're going to cry, and you're going to be like, Where would my troops go? My troops? What happened to them? Come on, dude. My fingers are, uh... Failing. I just want to make the rest of this... And then call a day. So I'm gonna go with this time right there. About a minute. Dude. What in the balls? Mm, actually, the last thing that I want to queue up is tier 6. So, when I still have... Can I even queue it up? Can I queue it up? Oh my god, I can't even queue it up. I can't even queue it up! Huh. Where'd my, where'd my silver go? Hmm. Alright, well, uh... <laughs> well, guys... That should be it, right? We're done? We're done? We're done? We're done? Wait, I got a minute more! What the? Dude, I thought it was in sync! Alright, 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 alright. So I got, I got a minute more. So I think that's what, like, uh... That's... It's about this many clicks, right? Oh shit, dude! Dude, the other resources! Yo, pop some of this... Pop some of this. Oh, but well, that's not enough. That's not enough. That's not enough. Alright. Until I run out of food. Ooh. Come on. Come on. I don't care about the event. Oh, Robin!
Oh, dude. Not like this. Do we make it? Do we make it? Oh! <clears throat> <coughs> to be honest, you shouldn't be going for uh, the level the level 11 to 15 if you want to keep your might low. Because... Because... I'll explain. And I blundered on this as well, which is why I'm just gonna... I, I, ideally, I wanted to stay as like a 10 to 12 billion might castle. But... What ended up happening was I started leveling them. As you can see right here, right? I just did, I did, I did tens for the most of them, right? Because my plan originally was to get these to 15 and then I would just go across the entire board, right? Look at this. I started going 15 and then I was like, you know what? This first portion of this tree blows a gigantic cock and you don't get much for it. You get, you get like chump change for stats. You get 60% for a 15 tree, right? And so I thought about it and I was like, man, that's actually straight dog shit. And I don't really want it that badly. <laughs> I was ranked 10 for all that clicking. Yikes. Uh, so what's the next one? Gather resources? Well, uh, gathering resources suck. And that's actually something that I never do. So, uh, <laughs> definitely not gathering resources. <clears throat> no, I, I understand that because in this game, they give you a ton of speed ups, they give you a ton of materials, but they don't give you resources. And so, technically, your real costs in this game are just the resources. If you, if you wanted to, uh, what's it called? get ahead of everybody else you're getting those weekly packs you're getting the premium packs and stuff like that right but uh <clears throat> man oh 17 bill 17 bill zero some kids let me let me make sure that everything is as you can see right here i, I don't have a guard captain that would have been pretty bad let me put my boy shaheen and gloria at the wall to defend uh oh i'll show you guys the hits oh yeah remember when i told you guys about uh what i've been doing for blood moon it's these see these this is this is this is blood moon right here this is blood moon right here blood moon that's all as it is chaotix bloodies that's it <coughs> actually I want to do some uh, some 35 bloodies. I don't think they just... I think this is not a fresh respawn. This is... Where is this? This is on this side, which respawns in 20 minutes. Huh. Okay. Let's look at the fort. Look at this. Blade Sanctuary. Nice. Good job, crazy. Mm, they've conquered this for about a minute. They pushed Majiya, so they can't have too many things in there. CAF. These are 1 bill, 1.6. Do they have this reinforced? They could have this reinforced, but let's look for a better... So this OG killer guy just hit it off. Where is he? Where is he? I want to hit a sanctuary with troops. Oh dude, look at this guy. 200k troops. This one's walking back. Two hundred k troops. I wonder what else is in here. If I s wait, they just took this. So I don't know if it's reinforced or not. I want to hit a sanctuary with troops in it. 
I think Rosie's still holding four, right? Okay, good. Man, they're getting so many free points off of this. <clears throat> They've had it for three and a half hours. All right, let's see. This tile hitting. I want to find. I want to find someone that's doing bloodies. You're against me for Blood Moon? Yeah, man, we're in K52. Excuse me. Apparently, Battle Tree 2 is uh, 14 billion might. <clears throat> Yikes. All of these have been recently taken. Let's see, is anyone hitting bloodies? Usually the best time to find kills is when there's a bloody kill bloody event. Oh my god, dude, it's not for another two hours. As you can see right here, we're we're in the lead by seven a billion. Did this guy get zero? He hasn't moved for a while. Uh, I kind of want to get hit. Actually, that's not a kind of. I do want to get hit. Let me hit these bloodies. Nine bill. I want to get hit. I want to get hit. Lol, this guy bounced off of a 31. Oops. Hmm. I need to just farm the 31 plus buddies. I need to find an area with a bunch of bloodies. So, there's actually a good amount in this area. I gotta make sure that my guard captain's set. Alright, guard captain set. I need to farm some silver. But, wait, what happened to my music? It's back. So, the 33 suck because I have a lot of stone. I, I just have like an insane amount of stone. I don't think I'm ever gonna go through this stone. It's, I just have way more stone than everything else. This, this stone count is like, it's insane. I'm not going to catch up with uh, the other resources. Wait a minute, what? How'd I bounce off of this? What? What?
Oh! I know. It's because... It's because I used to have the slaughter on this guy. But I gave him the conqueror set because my slaughter's not plus 10 yet. And... Which means I don't have the plus 6 from, uh... Or the tier 6 buff. And actually the slaughter set has more stats. But since I defaulted it that way, and didn't sw swap to Maria, that's what happens. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna keep doing the 35s. Let me swap this. Did I swap there? Oh dude, she's still Archer. I'm goofing. Whatevs. Whatevs, whatevs, whatevs. Uh, let's see if there's any 34s because I need iron as well. So, how about you guys? How's your... How's your Blood Moon bit? Because, to be honest, to get any action for this Blood Moon, we're gonna have to wait for the, the Chinese and the Japanese dudes to wake up. Until then, no one's gonna hit me. <laughs> oh, yeah! I haven't showed you guys my hits yet. I've taken a couple hits. Delete these. So, my first hit was this guy for 14.5 uh, million troops. I lost 9.5k. You got zeroed. Holy shit, how'd that happen? It's, it's kind of cheap to, to heal, right? So, I got these two hits within the first 21 minutes of Blood Moon. It was pretty nice. So, I got, I got, I got this 10 million, 11 million, so what? That's nearly 26 million kills in... <clears throat> in 21 minutes. Uh, this was the first hit. This is the big guy. This is their 70 billion guy. As you can see here, he sent a full tier 7 infantry march. Which is the exact counter to my composition, right? Because I, I run a cavalry composition. So, I did the max amount of damage that I could do to him with him still walking back. So, I came out on top in points because it's a full tier 7 march and all he wounded were uh, tier 3s and tier 4s. So I came out on top in terms of points. My pride hurt. Uh, the heal didn't cost that much. I think the heal only costed like 2 billion food or something. But that's definitely a lot cheaper than what he had to spend to revive 1.6 million tier 6. <clears throat> For this hit, I came out hugely on top. This is the other Chinese guy. This is the 28 bill Chinese guy. He started off at 26 billion. But he grew 2 billion uh, overnight. Because this is actually the guy who has contributed the most points to our kingdom. This guy has sent so many solos at people. He soloed me. He soloed Fearless. He soloed Crazy. He soloed Rosie. Right? He's given us so many points. I think this guy alone has given us maybe... Maybe like 11 to 15 billion points. This this one guy right here. If doing your familiars daily counts as playing Lords Mobile, then yes. <laughs> we recently migrated, but uh, I'm stuck behind in the Old Kingdom because I don't have no scrolls. We went to a really expensive migration kingdom. I think we took up like uh, out of the top... Out of the top like 50 we would have to fill like 45 of them <clears throat> but it's a very populated kingdom we went to it because uh there's actually been some pretty good zeros some pretty good rallies so far but uh you know it is what it is oh dude i completely forgot about my my, my english pasty my english state pasty mm. English steak past. Hmm. Do I eat this here? Uh, let's see. What can I do? You know what? 
I'm gonna play this like I play normally, and that's gonna be... I port here, which is my favorite section of the map. Right in the middle of these two sanctuaries and a little bit away from the, the base. And I gotta shield up because I gotta take my cav hero. <clears throat> So I'm going to move these out. I'm going to eat for like 10 minutes while I uh, do strongholds. And if the Chinese and the Japanese guys don't come active during that time, then I'm probably going to turn off the stream uh, because, you know, there's there's not much action, right? Because right now our guild pretty much controls all of the sanctuaries and we control uh, the base. And there's not much to do, you know? So what do you want me to do? So 35s are gone. I gotta turn on Stronghold Auto Hunt. Turn this on. Maybe there's some 34s. No 34s. 33s? You know, as much as I don't want to do 33s, I'm gonna do 33s. I'm gonna set uh Rand. Send Rand to do these. Uh, the 32s I do want, which is wood. I will send this one. Mm, 31 is food. I actually want food now. So I'm going to send Gloria after food. For the 30s. There should be a lot of people hitting these 30s, right? Yeah, a lot of people are hitting 30s, so I'm just gonna chill chill out from the 30s. I'm gonna do what uh, is easily farmed. Without competition, and I can just get them uh, with ease. So I'll do the 28s as well. This is the lower version of the 33s. Okay. Yo, Worthy, what's up, dude? Oh, you, they're called Cornish Passies? Yo! So there's this uh, British pub uh, a couple miles away. Uh, actually, it's like, it's like a mile and a half away. It's pretty close. And no one goes in there except for old people. <laughs> and so I uh, just happened to stumble upon it one day. So I don't know if I want to do 26s. I think I'll just stack on the 27s. And so this is gonna be, this is the stream right here, guys. This is a, this is the auto, auto hunt session. Hey, worthy, how's your streams been, dude? You still stream Lords? I haven't really watched Lord streamers for a while. So the reason why I like this one the most is because the gravy and this and this steak pasty is probably the best gravy I've ever had in my life. It's just so good. It's the best. <clears throat> wait, wait, do you guys wanna You guys wanna listen to some uh, ASMR while I'm eating? It, it doesn't sound that great. All it is is me tearing into this bread. And uh and eating the pasty, I guess. Mmm, the mushrooms. Mmm. 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 Yo, thanks for the warm wishes, Worthy. You ain't miss much. You ain't miss anything, actually. Have you tried this game at all, Worthy? Iron Throne? Wait, wait a minute. I heard of this game from you, Worthy. It's your fault.
This is actually your fault, Worthy. I remember you flew out to LA. You told me you went out to like the Net Marble Studios here in LA. And, uh, and you did some promo with them, right? And so this is the beginning of when I was like, well, what the fuck is Iron Throne? <laughs> Dude, the gravy in this is so good. It's so good. Ties, I think it's more than that. <laughs> it's more than that. It is more than that. <laughs> More in that. Wait. How exactly do we take capital? Did you play Iron Throne at all, or did you just, uh, did you just promote it? You guys liking this, uh, this ASMR stream? I got a bunch of INS members uh, playing Iron Throne. I know exactly what you mean with that because to stay relevant in Lords you kind of have to buy like the daily packs and stuff like that you got to get the, the specials you got to get the even the five dollar packs like the the um, bursting gem pack right you got to get those you got to get uh, a sweet deal which is 20 you got to get uh, what's it called the 20 dollar packs like material madness and shit like that right uh, let me see. Yo, are you still using Nox or Bluestacks? Because this one right here, it's called LD Player. This is actually like... This is the superior emulator. All the other emulators, all those other emulators suck dick. Hmm. Look at this. This is 1080p. Give it a sec. It's a little slower because I've had this other client on for a while. Sorry that I'm talking while I'm uh, eating and saying sorry while I'm eating. It does, way less CPU. So, for an example, right? 
For Nox, Blue Stacks, uh, actually the exception to this is Memu. Memu is still pretty decent, but I don't know if you've ever ran like multiple clients, like like four or five plus clients. Um, it it taxes your PC, right? When you're starting when you're starting to run multiple clients, but as you can see for this, right? I have two 1080p clients, right? Two 1080p clients running, and look how smooth it is. Everything is running smoothly. There's a Oh my god, dude! I I ran out of AP. I'm a monkey. All right, give me a sec. Uh, I gotta reset my my boys. Uh, let's, uh, let's put her in there. Give me a sec. I gotta, I gotta have my, I gotta have my, my strongholds running. I gotta have the strongholds running. Wait, which one has, this one has it, right? Wait a minute. Whatever, dude. I don't care. They can, they can do all of these. Give me a sec. Bear with me, bear with me, bear with me. Bear with me, bear with me. So... Where is she? Where'd she go? This guy on this. 33 is stone. 34 is iron. Let's put Rand on iron. And are there 35s? There are 35s. And let's put John on the 35s. Alright, guys. Auto hunt enabled. This that's actually like one of the best things in this game. Auto hunt. Auto hunt, auto hunt, auto hunt. I heard there is attack armor and iron throne that gives you extra attack against tier one and tier two to stop people from mass building them on the chief to trap. Well the thing is, what you do against that is uh You just make the next tier. You make some tier threes instead. <laughs> So yeah, basically what, what, what happened there is, uh, I think they released it in December. I started playing this game in March, April, no, no, May. I started playing this game in May. So, uh, they released that level 40 gear set, which fucked the tier two troops. What are they talking about hold for a few hours? They took like four or five hits and then the guy went to sleep. And it wasn't even the 70 bill guy, it was a 28 bill guy. All right. So the only real things that I do in Lords are these buttons right here. You see this is Convocation. Get some tier 4 troops for free. Lucky stars. Get some stars for free. Stroke of fortune. Get some gems for free. And then, and then these right here. Wait, you can trade for sigils? I'll trade for sigils. Um, 
do the Labyrinth, right? Get your one free Elite hit of the day. Oh, exactly what I wanted. Some wall repair. Hmm. Thank you, IGG, for the wall repair. Hey, Andy Otis. You get your, uh, your Tycoon spin? Actually, I should be doing this more often. Because I'm pretty close to, uh... The gold halo. I think I am, like, 14... 14 green halos away from, a uh, A gold cup. So, yeah, I'm 14, 14 green halos away from a gold cup. The Wolfpack Sigil? So the Wolfpack Sigil basically makes it so that, uh, I think it goes up to 1600. And if you are at, if you are at 1600 total sigils, right? Then uh, I think the max that each thing can have is like 160 so you can have 160 times three let's look i don't know so 40 i think i think it's 40. so the most one person can attribute is like 320 i think right 320 is the most one person can attribute but at 1600 wolf pack attack um you gain a hundred percent troops troop attack right troop attack or army attack it's called army attack in lords mobile it only applies for wonders uh, but it's what these sigils are for uh i should be afk in this gear <coughs> i haven't killed my daily monster actually let me go kill that let me stop being a degenerate click the helps Get this mystery box. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I gotta, I gotta level up this right here. I do it until nine. I didn't get lucky there. I didn't get like a time store or anything. So back to the monster hunting gear. I'm gonna go kill a monster. Uh, pass a big pass on that my dude dude the very first thing that I do uh, or what I did there that you guys didn't see is that I tried to zoom out because uh, when when you get out of town when you click the the world button here to get to this screen you can actually zoom out a little bit further so that's what I did here and that's what I tried to do on this one you know one of the things that sucks about Lords Mobile is how you don't have this search function Right? You can't just be like, yeah, well, I want to kill a level 33 monster. I want to kill a level 36 monster. Right? And then it shows you where it is. Nope. You got to sit here. And you got to go look. Where's a level 3 monster? You guys see a level 3 monster? Oh, I found one. So this needs physical damage, right? There's another one. There's another one. It's physical damage, right? Physical damage. How many hits am I at? I'm at times nine right now, so it would do. Would this do nine percent? That was eight point something, right? Eight point something. I think the next hit is nine percent. Uh, hey, whatever. I'll, I hit it one more time. If I was AFK in Monster Hunting gear, then I would have just been able to times 14 this. Oh, I was right! It was 9%. I could have just clicked it. Uh, 
Well, it gives me time to eat my pasty, so. I sold my trap count. So. I'm really close to Mythic Boots. <gasps> what happened here? What the heck? Did I did I low roll on that hit? I low rolled on that hit, I think. Whatever, man. It is what it is. My pasty is done. Wait, why is my hit six out of seven? My marches. So, uh, I mean, I'm being a good boy. So I have a march that's not doing anything. 33s, send another one to do the, oh, I got it. The 35s right now, I think. You know, the other thing I also don't like about Lords is how they're now releasing these new heroes, right? And the new heroes are what, like, uh, 1250, right? They're 1250 each. And in Iron Throne, they actually have events, like shop events, that make the already cheap $20 heroes. Or wait, are they $20 or are they $10 each? I think there's, I think they're $20 each. But anyways. Uh, they recently released, I think, two or three heroes at five dollars each. The last one was John, and if I recall, they did it for Mikoto as well. But they sold the heroes for five dollars each, and I think there's only what, like, eight or nine of them that are paid seven, eight, or nine paid heroes, and uh, they're relatively easy to obtain. Uh, they have a little bit more stats than the, the free heroes that you get. But in the end, in this game, the free heroes are actually the strongest heroes in the game. <coughs> Can you show me your lord skills in Throne? Oh, my lord skills. I'm, I'm just using this one. This is my, uh, my battle talent, which gives me the, what's called? the largest deployable troop size that I can send. So I have it maxed out to, uh, what's it called? To this one right here, deployable troop size three. And then I have deployable troop size two somewhere here, right? And then I need a little bit more points to fully max it out and get this last 9,000 so that I'm good permanently for uh, what's called deployable troop size for solo attacks. So that's what I'm currently statted on. Uh, as for movement speed, I don't, I don't really think that I'm, uh, that I'm statted for movement speed. It's just this one right here, the troop march speed at the beginning, but it's a prerequisite, so I needed it anyways. Uh, my troops walk fast because I have the stronghold march research, right? Also, this is in Blood Moon, and in Blood Moon you get, you get these. Uh, oh, it's, it's, it's this button. In Blood Moon, I think there's, uh, you get a troop march buff, right? So, I think this is what Blood Blood Moon is. Golden Kalepolis. It's this right here. Troop March Speed. Wait, why do they call it Golden Kalepolis? Golden Kalepolis. Are those the Roman numerals? Well, what, what, what number is that? Does that does this rep does this represent uh fifth dude eighty eighty seven I don't know how to read uh Roman numerals. I'm I'm actually an idiot. So there's one thing that I have to give lords. That Lords does better. And the thing that Lords does better are formations. Lords does formations way better because 
it's not even an Iron Throne. In Iron Throne, your front line is determined by your lowest tier of troops, right? Um, it's no secret what my composition is, right? I stack cavalry. So when you stack cavalry, <coughs> and this is actually uh, the new meta, or quote unquote new meta, which makes it so that you no, you no longer have uh, majestic and siege as your guard captain and your guard deputy. You now want to stack one troop type, which means that uh, for your guard captain and your guard deputy, you go with uh, your lowest tier troop type and whatever you, uh, whatever you have as your guard captain and your guard deputy will be your lowest tier troop type and the thing that you amass the most tier six with, right? I don't know all of the specifics when it comes to the actual gameplay, the battle mechanics, so forth, yada yada. Uh, as far as it comes, we haven't really fought that many times, right? And when we do fight people, when we do want to test certain things, it's kind of in Golden Moon. But I do appreciate that we even have Golden Moon, right? Because whatever is lost in Golden Moon is not real. <clears throat> now, I, I've gotten countered already, right? The 70 Bill guy... The 70 Bill guy hit me with a full tier 7 march. And it did 24 mil. Mind you, this is when I still had 69 million troops. Uh, how many troops do I have now? I think I have 130, 140 mil troops. So I doubled my troop count. I gave myself more meat shield. And so I'm at 119 mil troops. <coughs> uh, I really wish that I could have made a little bit more, but I ran out of time. And... I like making it during those time periods anyways. Uh, what's going to be the next event? Bloody Stronghold and Conquered Sanctuary. Holy, we're up 8.4 billion points. What am I at? Still third place? All right, good, good, good. Dude, Rosie and, and Fearless are getting so many points from sitting in capital. They literally just sit in capital. Like Rosie? Rosie hasn't moved! She's actually shielded right now. I kinda wanna take capital to get those dang juicy points. Wait. Yo, did this guy port next to me? So that he can auto next to me? Uh, I gotta check. I just noticed that I'm at 6 out of 7 again. So I have a 33, I have a 32. I don't have a 30, a 31. Okay, I'll do I'll do 31s. I kind of want food anyways. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. That's a 70 bill guy, right? Wait, where you go? Where you go? He's here somewhere. It's got to follow the blue line. Wait, that's... Oh, dude, they got hit off of it. Where, where are you at? Where's he at? Where's he at? I'm sure it's going to get posted here somewhere. Ooh, ooh, take cap. It's, it's so funny. Y'all say it like it's... You had it for four hours uncontested when they were sleeping and you're trying to pass it off like we can just fucking take it from the 70 bill and the... I'm tilted! <laughs> Wait.
Wait a minute. It's a 28 bill. I canceled all of them. I actually don't think that I can win against the 28 bill guy. Wait a minute. I I can't hit him because he has archers. If I hit archer on archer, I would lose. Gotta make sure that everything's set. I just wanna see what's inside. So it already got reinforced. You literally got I am so tilted, dude. I could have sold the first guy out with a cab march. Okay, so we can just magically hit people of our kingdom now, right? <clears throat> Tips for restricted kingdoms. Uh... Sorry, man. I'm, I'm, I'm highly irritated. <clears throat> I'm so irritated. I'm so irritated. You can't get past C29, uh... They... somewhat... Somewhat made it nicer for...
I'm so mad! Like this guy right here? What's his name? Come get some? What have you done? You haven't done anything! Look at you! Oh dude, I'm so, I'm so mad. <sighs> Give me a sec, I actually have a phone call.
Well, I'm back. Hello, how's everything? Ooh. Did they reinforce him or something? Oh. That's spooky. Ah. Uh, thanks for the heads up. <laughs> Abdullah. I love you. I want you to know that, Abdullah. I love you. All right. I would have never seen that rally. If, uh, <laughs> if, if you didn't tell me about it. What? Dude, that was, that was clutch. <laughs> I actually want to hit this guy. I know that he has 50 million troops. Oh, dude. Dude, that was, that, wow. Wow. <laughs> that would have been pretty costly. Because that guy knows my composition. He knows that I have cavalry. So that rally was, uh, was infantry. So they would have had like a three, four million march. Wow. Um, I only want to take solos, not rallies. What's in here? One of the things that sucks about this game is this forest. It makes everything go much, so much slower. I don't know the exact... Uh, Calculation on how much slower it is, but it is so much slower. Yeah, so it's a 28 billion guy in there, and he's reinforced. I hit that 50, the guy with 50 million troops before, it wasn't that favorable. I only won by a couple of points. I only won by maybe like four or five thousand points. But in the end, it cost me revival herbs and stuff like that, right? And it just cost him food. <clears throat> Wait, is this a rally? Oh, shit. I wasn't even watching. <laughs> what did I get hit by? My might didn't drop that much, so uh, I won on uh, on that end, right? So let's look at it. <laughs> so this is definitely a win. That's definitely a win. Let me just heal these up real quick. <clears throat> uh, let me dismiss these.
I actually took it in the wrong talents. It's it's not that much of a difference, but I took it in the wrong talents. Um, if you, if you look here, wait, why do I have to revive something? Oh, yeah, I put him in there, that's why. Uh, where's the thing? <clears throat> Give me a sec. To be completed. Okay. So, uh, yeah, that was, uh, value. Dude, that guy is actually a monkey. I thought it was a rally at the beginning, and then I was like, wait a minute. That's, uh, let me save this one too. So let's analyze what happened here. He hit me with ranged. He hit me with ranged on my predominantly cavalry setup. Huh. Wow. His stats are huge. He has 300%. All right, the 3.1000% with a majestic secondary. I'll take that. What does that put me in points? Hey, I went up like 400 mil. <coughs> I'll take that. I hope he hits me with infantry. If he hits me with infantry, it will still be worth it. <laughs> Dude, that was nice. Where is it? This one. Oh yeah, I can't do dimensional battle while I'm in here. <clears throat> so the cool thing about this game, which which definitely has a plus on Lords, is that uh, in this game, you can solo people, you can get soloed, there's uh, rallies and stuff. Oh yeah, oh yeah. One thing this game is missing is that it doesn't have Battle Fury. It doesn't have Battle Fury. That's that's kind of that's kind of shitty to be honest. But I guess it's it's good because if you get hit in this game, uh, it can be devastating. <laughs> it can be very devastating. Like one hit from someone that's max could just wipe you out completely. Yeah, this game does require a lot of, uh, what's called, processing power to run. Because my phone runs out of battery so fast. He only hit with 500k? Oh. <clears throat> Go to him? I don't think he's going to hit me, dude. If anything, they're going to rally me or something. Um, it kind of sucks that I started streaming now. Uh, man, it'd be nice if Crazy was here. Because what we did at the beginning of this was uh, we swapped names. So what ended up happening was the guy thought that, the guy thought that uh, he had just hit me twice, right? And then I swapped names with Crazy. So myself and Crazy are at similar mites. And 
what that guy did, uh, the same guy that soloed me just now, is uh, he probably thought that I was crazy. And because we swapped names back again, right? So crazy runs an infantry lineup, right? And I run a cavalry lineup. The reason why this guy sent ranged at me was because he thought I was crazy. <laughs> so we swapped names like twice, right? So uh, we swapped names so that I'm crazy and he's Sneaky Tashi. And then we swapped names back. So I'm back to being Sneaky Tashi and he's back to being crazy. So the guy hit me with full range thinking... <laughs> Uh, yes, rallies are stronger. There's a second set of rally buffs, right? So you can increase the march size. There's some more uh, rally stats that goes along with rallies. I think there's another extra like thousand something percent when uh, you take rallies into account. Dude, that is so funny. I need to share this with Crazy. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> it makes sense. It makes sense. Oh my god. That is so funny, dude. It makes it, it makes it makes perfect sense when uh when you think about it like that. So that means we bamboozled this guy three times now. That feels so good, man. Wait a minute. I remember I turned on my stream because I just wanted to show the duels. And then it became a Blood Moon stream. And then I have Lord's Mobile open. And now I'm actually doing Blood Moon. I did the training and stuff. This was supposed to be a 13 minute stream. Uh, how long is it? It's been two hours? It's been two hours. been two hours huh guys this is a lot longer than I wanted to stream I actually see the, the content dying down because uh, what's it called it's primetime China time these guys have like a 70 bill guy the the 25 bill plus guys are gonna start being active again and uh, what they're gonna do is they're just gonna fill capital and the, the sanctuaries and it's pretty hard to contest against that right because for one I think Rams have been busy, but in the end, right, life, you always take life first, right? So, I'm never going to blame anybody for for choosing to to do whatever they're doing in real life over the game, right? So, whatever it is, it takes priority, right? So, we can't really compete, is what I'm trying to say. And I'm not going to blame Ram for it, because in the end, this is a game, right? There's no blame to be to be to be like taken or to be given to anybody because even then i don't think we can compete against a 70 billion guy they have a bunch of guys of course his kingdom is what like a month older than ours but at the same time this guy is overwhelmingly stronger than pretty much our entire kingdom right because how capital capitals work is it's it's pretty screwy it's essentially who has the better gear, who has uh, whatever whatever better than the other person. That's who wins, right? So there's not, there's not a lot of strategy that comes from taking capitals or sanctuaries in this game. Because in the end, it's purely numbers, right? Uh, as long as you hit with a counter, as long as you have a better composition than the enemy, then you should have a better chance of winning. That's it, right? You have better stats, you have better tier troops. That's it. That's all you really need. Right? So they have that and we don't. So what do we do? We just got to sit here and take it because we can't do anything about it. So that's kind of what it is. And it sucks. It's not good content. It sucks being on the loser side of things, right? Uh, though I did win in terms of points, it still sucks burning 
It sucks losing those resources, though as minimal as it is. Uh, but it is nice seeing these numbers, right? Because this is uh, tier 7 and tier 6. When all I lost were wounded tier 3s. This actually would have been a lower number because uh, I had the siege. Uh, but it would have been a much lower number if I didn't have the siege there. <clears throat> Which is why I just sent the siege to the temple anyways. So, uh, it is what it is. Guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. It's been two hours. Uh, that's it. So that's uh, duels, training troops, Blood Moon, getting hit at Blood Moon. And uh, yada yada. Have a good day. Adios. Bye bye. Am I getting hit again? Wait, this is a rally. <clears throat> that was a rally. Uh, <laughs> well, I almost got hit with a rally. <clears throat> I'm glad I didn't get hit by the rally, but uh, guys, have a good day. Bye-bye. <laughs> that was spooky.